Good morning from not so sunny Florida, but it's going to get sunnier throughout the week. We've been here a couple of days. Flight went well. Yesterday we took a pontoon boat ride, which I'll put a little video in for you. And now, Mom and I on our, are on our way to Gila and Nolan's house to have some brunch and decorate cookies, which will be fun. And I've dressed all festive. You can't see it now because I'm in my raincoat, but I got some of Mom's Christmas leggings on with leopard and my Christmas t-shirt, which you'll have to see later. And then, of course, jingle bell earrings. And let me put my little crown on to show you. My crown that makes me feel like the Statue of Liberty. Let me find the button. Here's the first setting, crazy flashing lights. Then, less flashing. And then, just stays on solid i think is more my vibe but there you go lots of christmasy fun to be had today and then the boys will be joining us later where we might be playing games or doing other fun stuff so it's already been a fun filled couple of days and there's so much more fun to be had but i'll try to be good about showing you but sometimes it's hard when i just want to enjoy time with family so we will see, but see you when we're decorating cookies. We had a good morning taking a walk at Smyrna Dunes. It was chilly at first, but warmed up and was a nice walk. And now I'm going to make dog biscuits for Oliver for Christmas. So, never made them before. They're peanut butter dog biscuits. Hopefully it goes well. Welcome to Mom's Christmas Decor Home Tour. She's done a beautiful job this year. She's got big bulb ornaments on this tree. She's got lights on her palm tree. Lights all on the bushes. So we'll start with this side. And then some light up packages. A little Santa Claus that says Season's Greetings. Oh gosh, she's got little touches everywhere. I can't even keep track of it all. She's got some in that planter over there. A wreath. And even more lights on the trees.
she's got her village up this year. And this is just a small taste. I'm not going to be able to show you everything because there's so much and so much detail everywhere that I don't even know where everything is. Really, I should have her give you the tour, but she's busy making dinner. did not vlog anything today because I was just being present and enjoying the time with family. But we had an enjoyable day, got some last minute things done that I needed to do, went out to a yummy breakfast, I had a Nutella waffle, we watched the movie 8-Bit Christmas tonight, it was very entertaining, it's on HBO if you want to know. But yeah, I've been a little more relax on the vlogging because of the fact that I'm just trying to enjoy time with family. But tomorrow is Christmas. Should be a fun-filled and packed day. I'll try to capture some of it for you if I can and remember. And don't want to interrupt the festivities. But I hope, obviously by the time you see this, Christmas will be over. But I hope you had a great Christmas. I hope you're enjoying the time with family and hope Santa was good to you. So, I'll see you tomorrow. Merry Christmas. It's time to make the cinnamon buns. Mm. 
And just like that, the cinnamon buns are done. Today has been a really good day. I enjoyed the time with family. We had a great Christmas. I showed you a little bit of the present and stocking unwrapping, but not much else. But we had a good dinner, watched a Christmas Hallmark movie at the end of the day, but also started playing a game which will continue tomorrow. But I don't know, the day just went by real fast and like the whole week has but we've been enjoying ourselves having fun and relaxation and maybe it's because I haven't been here in a while but it does seem like it's going by extra fast but I have enjoyed the time with family very much and had a very wonderful Christmas and normally this is where vlogmas would end but I'll probably continue it till I get home, do a little ending for you once I'm home, but tomorrow is kind of a mix of relaxing and fun again, because we're hopefully going to take a walk on the beach, you know, enjoy and bask in this nice weather while we can, because today it was in the high 70s, we ate outside. And at home right now, there's ice storms and snow and cold going on. So that's what I've got to look forward to going back to. Plus just real life reality, which in some aspects is good. I'm very excited to see Duncan. He's been doing pretty well while I've been away, which is good. Hopefully that continues over the next couple of days. And, but like, having to clean, organize, deal with all those things you have to deal with as an adult. Not not too, as excited for that, but that's life. You gotta take the good with the bad and the fun with the not so fun. And what else are we doing tomorrow? Walk on the beach, finish our game, go out to lunch. I'm taking my brother and James and my other brother to lunch because, partly because James and Nolan, my brother, did so well in school this year. They worked very, very hard and got really good grades, so I wanted to commend them and celebrate them for that. And my other brother has just been very helpful and supportive of the family in many ways, so he deserves thanks as well. I don't know, I feel like I'm just being rambly as as can happen with me on here. So hopefully, I mean, I have lots of footage to edit. I haven't edited or even looked at my footage for the past 10 days, but as I had warned you in the beginning of the month that that would probably happen because I didn't want to put pressure on myself to get it done. I wanted to enjoy so I can deal with that, not deal with that, but complete that when I get back home. But there's gonna be a lot but at the same time, I don't know exactly what I've got and I feel like it's gonna be a lot of montages and not much of this of me talking and sharing because I'm not the best at that. But I hope that you will enjoy it regardless, even if you're seeing this in January, which is quite the possibility depending how much editing I get because I also still have to post my yearly favorites and still have not recorded my year-end book video, but I feel like that's okay if it goes up in January because it's still talking about all my 2021 books 
and is far away from any 2022 book videos. But yeah, as once again, that's all for me to figure out at some point. But I'm not stressing. I feel like I've been doing a very good job of not stressing. Maybe it's the Florida climate. I don't know. But I do feel like I have been doing a good job of that and trying to focus on the things happening now and not stressing or worrying about things in the future or that typically I only stress about and nobody else really probably even thinks about. So there you go. And I said two minutes ago that I was getting rambly and probably should end, but I didn't. So, so I'll say goodbye now. Bye. home it was a very very early morning because we weren't sure how much time we would need at the Orlando airport you might be able to tell so yeah our flight wasn't until like 10 a.m. but because my parents live a little bit of a distance we were up like just after 5 so really early and therefore it's been a long day of traveling and all of that and getting settled and it was nice to come home to Duncan. He was happy to see us. He's got a new toy that his Floridian grandparents gave him for Christmas, but I didn't realize it needs charging, so it's charging right now, and hopefully I can show you him playing with it later. But yeah, it was overall a good smooth day, just as I said, tiring but just relaxing gonna do some more settling in and unpacking and all of that fun stuff later tomorrow afternoon but it was a good trip we had a good time and it was good to see everybody of course always nice to come home as well especially back to your adorable kitties so that do you want to say hello Duncan come here nobody's seen you for a week you're making me look bad. Fine, I'm going to show you from over here. You're going to be stubborn. He doesn't want to come up right now, so this is the best I can do. But I missed his cute little face. He only destroyed a couple toys while I was gone, but... The tree was still standing, so that was... Oh, of course you're going to turn your back to the camera and not show your face. Of course. It's like you know. You little stinker. What the heck? That's what you get for now, because that's what Duncan wants to show you. So, Hi. there you go. I think we had a great trip overall. Everybody in Florida was so nice. Aaron's family was so nice to me. Uh, it made the trip that much more uh, exciting and better. Uh, we got to do a lot of great things and I can't wait to go back again. Good job! Duncan's about to play with his new fish. Are you gonna be scared of it or like it? <laughs> yeah, no, probably. But I like it when it's not moving. Well, I don't want it to scare him. <laughs> don't get scared, Duncan, it might move. Oh, 
I don't know how to dunk it. I think you gotta get used to it. Hello, it is about a week later now, and I wanted to give Vlogmas a proper closing. And I'm gonna try not to make it too long because I know this is already a long, the longest Vlogmas so far. But I hope that you enjoyed it this year. I certainly enjoyed creating it for you. I'd love to know what you thought about the different format. So instead of me recording every single day to have something every single day, me only recording when it was more intentional and things were going on and sharing that with you. So I'd love to know your feedback for next year if you'd like to see it the same as this year or if you like seeing me do something every single day. Let me know. Otherwise, I hope that you have an amazing year. Of course, you'll see me in more videos coming up soon. I'll try to do more vlogs throughout the year as well as my other videos. But of course, I'm always open to your requests and would love to hear what you would like to see. 2021, the beginning of it was challenging for me, but I got through it. I got stronger. I, again, surprised myself with things I could do that I didn't think I could do, but the year just got better and better as it went on, and I'm very excited and hopeful and looking forward to this new year of 2022. And of course, my battery's going to die, but that's probably a good thing because it will keep me from rambling too long. But thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting my channel. I hope you enjoyed Vlogmas. Give it a thumbs up if you did, and I will see you soon in another video.